A few days ago we made a video on how to create consistent character images for our AI influencer model. If you have watched the video already, then I am sure now you can generate character images with the same face and reference images. If you didn't watch the video, then pause this video right now and watch my previous AI influencer video from the i button or from the description box. Alright, I hope you have already watched the video. Many new creators want to know how to change the expression of the face and make a video with the same character. In this video, I am going to share the method of changing the facial expression of my AI influencer. In the next part of the video, I will share the method of generating a video with the same character. So, let's dive in. You can easily change the facial expression of any model on Photoshop, but the problem is. It demands high expertise with a huge time. Don't worry, as we have found an AI tool that can change the facial expression of any image, now you can also change any image face with a few clicks in under one minute. And the name of the tool is Hey Photo. it's a 100% free AI image manipulation platform. Here you can change gaze direction, nose shape, skin tone, age, hairstyle, and other facial features. Not only that, you can even swap faces and create lifelike headshots for your social media profile. Alright, to find the Hey Photo AI tool, open a new tab and search for Hey Photo AI. After getting the search result, click on the first result. After coming to the home page, click on the sign up button from here. Create an account with email and password, or continue with Apple, GitHub, Google, or Facebook accounts. I will go with my Google account. After creating the account, your interface will be like this one. Now we have to upload our desired image. I will upload one of my previous AI model images. Just drag and drop an image on here. And here it is. Our image has been uploaded. Now let's try how it works. On the left side, you will find the options. And the first option is to look at bird. Here we have this bird here. And what it does, if I drag this bird, you can see her eyes movement is changing. OK. So if I move it a little bit further, you can see on the left side. So if I move this bird on the right side, you can see her high movement is changing towards the right side. And if I move this on the upward side, here it looks really, really horrible. And if I move this down a little bit here, you can see now she's looking downwards. But the overuse of this one can also make your images worse. So I would recommend you to go with the very slight movement. So here you can see it looks really, really good here. And you can also see the details on the face. You can see the wrinkles around the eyes. It looks really natural. So this option is also really cool. You can also try this one, but I would like to reset my image because we had to try some other features. So the next one is the anonymized. So these are some kinds of filters that you can apply and it does change your facial expressions just to make your face unrecognizable from the ear detection tools. So we're going to move on to the next tool which is smart. And this is a really cool tool and this is one of my favorites. And here you can see we have our slider here. So if I move this slider towards the left side, it's going to make it look like sad. And if I move this slider to the right side, it will make her face smile. So I'm going to move it a little bit here and this is now starting the processing. So here you can see a really subtle smile on her face. You can see even the lips are a little bit opened here. So if I move this a little bit more here and now her face is looking more smiley. And if we look at the details here, you can see the wrinkles around the eyes. It looks really natural. And you guys can also see some kind of the wrinkle lines around her lips. That makes it look natural. And let's say if I move this slider all the way to the right, now you can see it automatically generated the teeth and it also generated the dimple kind of thing on the left side you can see and the wrinkle lines that look really, really natural. But it also changed the character a little bit. You can see this is not our original character. It doesn't look like our original character. But it's a really cool feature. And if I move this slider to the left side, you can see the character looks similar. But there is some kind of like sad face here. Okay. So I think the sad face looks way more natural than the smiling face because the smiling face is generating the teeth. AI is trying to generate the teeth and wrinkles and all that stuff. So it does change the face a little bit. So if you guys don't want to try this feature, we also have the next option that is in motion. So I'm going to click on that. And you can see we have some emotions here like scared, surprise, happiness, disgust, and anger. So we're going to go with the scared face first. Okay. 
So look at that. Now she's looking scared. So let's try the surprise. Okay. So the surprised and scared look really similar. And let's try the happy. Okay. So it generated the extra layer of the teeth and also made her lips open. But again, it does change the original face. So you can also try the disgusted face here that I don't think it looks like a disgusted face. And the next one is the angry. Okay. So it's weird. So it's looking somewhere between the angry and the happy. But I think the smile slider works best instead of the emotions here. Alright, the next tool is gender. Here you can customize the face gender. If you slide it to the left side, then it will look like more female characters. And if you slide to the right, then it will be like a male character. Let's try it. It's really a cool feature to make some fun, but not useful for an influencer. But for sure you can use it to make some fun. Okay, the next step is age. You can change the age with this tool. If you slide it to the left, the face will look younger and if you slide it to the right, then it will look like an older face. You can see that when I change the value, the face is changing. So actually these are some kinds of filters that you can play around with. And I'm not saying that this is as good as the Photoshop version, but it does work well in most of the cases. And it also depends on your input image, right? Always give time to customize the image, then you will get a better result. Alright friends that's all about the AI Influencer Facial Expression Changer AI tool. In the next part of this video, I will show how you can generate actual videos with consistent characters, not only the deep fake. Alright, friends, I will wrap up our video now. Before that, I would love to hear about your experience with changing facial expressions with AI. Share your thoughts and results in the comments section below. Don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful and subscribe to our channel for more amazing tutorials like this one. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, happy creating!